Hello Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Welcome and welcome cross watchers. I'm going to take a look at your connections in love. So what's going on here with Libra? Also keep in mind that this is a general reading, so it may or may not resonate with everybody. If you'd like a personal reading, I'll leave the information down below. What's going on with Libra in love? We have religious factors. Your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path. Children. Your love life is being affected by children. Calling in your soulmate. Your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring you together. It is safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. And then we have finances and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. Okay. So for some of you, you are, are dealing with somebody or you could be the, somebody who wants children or somebody dealing with somebody who has children already and there's somebody around you who you have a deep connection with and this is a divine con connection so um, this could potentially be your soulmate and I feel like moving forward there's going to be a need for either you or this person to open up their heart and and be vulnerable have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation with each other tell me about religious factors king of cups so you could be dealing with a pisces cancer or a scorpio in your life here and what i'm seeing is that there's this person who is very serious who is emotionally stable who is mature okay and this person is somebody who is looking for something serious um this is a masculine energy so this could be you or your person i feel like it's your person that you're dealing with who is a water sign and there has been some type of change between you guys. So you could have ended things with this person. Uh, for some of you, this person feels like you're changing or you feel like they have changed and they have um, closed themselves up. But this person is not wanting to let you go regardless of this change that has happened between you guys. This tower moment, um, this breaking down of a foundation. Um, because somebody could have been sneaky, um, could have been manipulative. But this person, I see that they have been spying on you. So this person has been watching you regardless of if they're in your life or not. They have been watching you because they still have love for you. From what I see, they still love you. This is somebody from your past. Or this is somebody who has children. This could also be a Leo. But I'm seeing a lot of water energy. So there is somebody coming back from your past. Who could be a water sign or a Leo. Who is wanting to persuade you into having children with them. Or even uh, accepting their apology. Because they feel like you. this is worth it. And... They are building up the courage to come forward and speak to you. And they are no longer wanting to have conflict here with you anymore. So if you guys have been having arguments with this person or um, you've been feeling like there have been competition options, I see them dropping their options and coming to you wanting to reconcile with you or this could be somebody who is choosing you over other options that they have wanting to take you on a date even but from what i see there is a water sign that is wanting to reconcile for um, most most of you this is somebody from your past this could be a childhood friend also and i feel like if you've been doing some manifestations when it comes to this person calling in your soulmate prayers affirmations visualizations it is working 
they are coming forward and you're going to have this opportunity to have a conversation with them. And I feel like you are wanting the facts when it comes to this person because in some way, shape or form, either you or them deceived each other in some type of way. I uh, was wearing a false mask, could have been a third party with a fire sign, but I feel like this is your energy mostly. I feel like people are seeing you in a place that they are finding you very attractive and they are finding you uh, somebody who is very alluring. You could have a black cat, but I feel like you're really standing in your power and people are t starting to take notice of that. And it's very attractive and it's attracting this person from your past as well who is wanting to take action towards you and have a new passionate beginning. So I do see that you are going to have a conversation with this person uh, about some type of partnership in union. So I feel like this is what you're going to be speaking about so I feel like you're going to be very assertive when this person comes back around and you're not going to beat around the bush and you're going to say exactly what it is that you want you want a passionate new beginning and you want union with your soulmate here so and for some of you if there was a third party I see you addressing that so I do see you guys talking to each other and I see it being very passionate between the both of you. The only thing is, is that there's somebody who is very scared to to open up their heart and be vulnerable. Could be a Pisces. And they're not feeling like very confident about the fact that it is totally safe for them or you're not feeling totally confident about the fact that it's safe for you to love and there could have been some secrets revealed here so secrets are coming to light through this conversation or you may already know this and you're just addressing it that this person could have been kind of an attention whore um, somebody who just was like a serial dater dating multiple people and for some of you you're not listening to your intuition when it comes to this person and for some of you things won't really change if this person has done you wrong in the past things won't really change and, and let's see yeah secrets coming back to light so and I see that they're still going to be kind of deceptive towards you for some of you um, but if not, this is just a conversation that you're going to be having about secrets about this person, something that you already know or something that they found out about you that is coming off as untrustworthy and somebody wearing a false mask here and it's adding a lot of fears. So I feel like you don't feel like it is safe to love this person, even if you do care about them, even if you do love them because, because of these secrets and these hidden factors and you're not feeling that confident about this person because of what they did to you in the past or they may be somebody who's just in and out of your life and could be a player so you're watching this person a lot and for some of you I just kind of see you focusing on your career but I do see new beginnings in love for you um, somebody new coming into your life here could be an earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, or a Taurus who is wanting some type of long-term commitment with you. And they're wanting to begin in investing into this connection and you may meet them through work. And I feel like you won't have to fight for this person. You won't have to... Um, what's it called? You won't have to like feel unstable when it comes to them. There's going to be a new beginning here. So I see new beginnings moving forward because I see you having a lot of options. And I also see this person from your past coming back wanting a new beginning with you. Wanting to invest and commit themselves to you. And also, I feel like if you do decide to take this person back, you're no longer going to fight for this connection. Um... Things are going to be a little imbalanced because 
you're gonna let this person try to prove you wrong because you don't want to be a fool in this situation but this person's gonna end up taking a leap of faith towards you and if this is someone new i see them being committed i see them being someone who is going to fight for you and somebody who is going to have a lot of stability but also this could be somebody who is a workaholic and they work a lot so it's going to be hard to juggle work and you at the same time but they're willing to invest in you let's get some more cards this person in the past also i'm i'm getting that things could have ended because they needed to focus on their career because they weren't financially stable and now that they are they're wanting to they're wanting to offer you something solid. So what's going on here in love for Libra? What's going on here for love with Libra? What's going on? Friendship. Yeah, so this could be somebody who is coming back in still wanting to be a part of your life wanting to be friends with you this is something who somebody who you have a strong bond with but <clears throat> i feel like for some of you um you this could be like a childhood friend from your life like children or somebody who has children you're dealing so for some of you you're definitely dealing with somebody who has children and this can be a factor in this connection with you guys. And you're going to have a conversation about this. About if this is something you're okay with or you're, they're okay with. And I also see this um, conversation of you guys again. Some type of love triangle going on. So you are going to address that. I do see that. I see you addressing it. I see you being very assertive. And getting the facts straight. Because you want only facts moving forward. And if they don't give you the facts, I see you cutting this person off. But this is somebody who was destined to be in your life. Um, there's somebody who is fated to be in your life. And your intuition um, is trying to tell you that. But I feel like you're, you're kind of ignoring that because of these secrets. But there is true love for you guys here. So... Overall, your outcome is looking really good. So you just got to get past this this conversation that's going to be had, um, which is coming up for you guys in the near future here. Um, once you get past this conversation, I see true love coming in for you. And I see somebody who is committed, somebody who's willing to invest in you. And this could even be somebody who is financially stable. Somebody who who has um, wealth, I'm hearing. Somebody who has wealth for, for somebody out there who is your true love and who's wanting to invest in you and pursue you. And this won't be somebody who you have to fight for because they're going to be the ones that are going to pursue you. But you're going to have to make a decision on who it is that you want because I see you talking to multiple people. Um, we have triangle again, so you might have to choose between two people, somebody from your past and a new person, but out of these two people, there is true love for you. So things are looking really good for you guys. I feel like because of your energy, like I'm, I'm really liking your vibe where you're just like, you're not taking any more bullshit moving forward. You're going to address things as they are, and you're going to be totally honest about it. I'm hearing brutally honest, but, um, you know, do do what you got to do to get your facts across. And I see you taking your time and getting more information. So with these secrets here, mm -hmm, secrets are coming to light, and I see it, and I see you... Handing this person lies on a silver platter within the next few weeks. But listen to your intuition. Pay attention to your intuition. Um, what really helps me is like taking walks. Like literally not listening to any music. But just letting myself be in tune with my thoughts. That's what I kind of do to clear my mind. 
and communicate clearly yes what I see you doing communicating very clear being assertive and setting your boundaries because you're ready for this true love so you are ready you're in a place to accept true love and you're you just have to get past this conversation and I see things going uphill from here for you guys. So it's looking really good. I really like this reading. If you liked it, please comment, like, and subscribe. And hit the notification bell so you can be updated for future videos. Let me know if it resonated. And I hope that you found guidance and clarity in your situation. Thank you for watching. Bye.